Hello there, I'm Kafi Khan and welcome back to my Android tutorials. In today's video, we'll be talking about collapsing toolbar layout. So what is it? It is a wrapper for your toolbar which gives a collapsing effect to your application bar. So let's discover more about it. Let's start with a new project. Okay. So let's call our project collapsing toolbar tutorial. Let's hit the next button. Again, we're going to keep our minimum SDK 15 Y so that we can run our application on almost 100% of the devices running Android in the world. Let's hit the next button. Let's start with an empty activity. And let's call our first activity as main activity. Well, Android Studio is building our project, so let's wait. Well, the application is built and it's ready to go. And to use a collapsing toolbar layout, we'll need to add a dependency. So let's do that first. So coming to Gradle, so application Gradle, and let's add the dependency here. So implementation com dot android dot support design and a version which is twenty six point zero point one. Sorry, point one point zero. Well, let's hit the sync Gradle button. Well, the Gradle sync, and we're ready to use the collapsing toolbar layout. So let's just close this file and let's close this. And let's switch to the layout file that is main.xml. Let's switch to the text mode. Well, let's get rid of this constraint layout because to use a collapsing toolbar layout, uh, the parent layout should be coordinator layout. So let's use that here. So coordinator layout. Let's add the app bar here. So app bar layout with match parent, height wrap content. And here we need to add our collapsing toolbar. So collapsing toolbar layout with match parent, height wrap content. Okay. Let's add an image view and a text view. So image view with match parent height say 200 dp. Let's add an SRC, so we'll be needing an image resource, so let's add that. So let's just copy this one. Well, let's just paste it in our drawable folder. Okay, so coming back to our project, let's use the resource file here, so I see room. Let's check the preview once. Okay, let's just bring it here. So as you can see, we've got our collapsing toolbar. Let's add a toolbar here. So toolbar with match parent height ATTR and action bar size. Okay. Well, let's provide a theme. So theme, theme overlay app compat action bar. Okay. And we also need to provide a nested scroll view here. Okay, so let's add that with, with match parent height match parent and Let's add a text view in here or just copy paste this one here. So control X, control V. So we've got a text, it says hello world. Okay. Well, to achieve that collapsing effect, we need to add some more attributes. So let's do that. So app layout scroll flags. So scroll and exit until collapsed. Okay, similarly, we need to add some more attributes in image view. So let's add those. So app layout collapse mode, so which is parallax and similarly in toolbar. So app layout collapse mode, pin. Okay, and we also need to add some more attributes in this nested scroll view. So let's add those. So app layout behavior, app bar scrolling view behavior. Let's add a gravity here. So the out gravity says center, just to bring it in center. And let's run our application and see what we've built so far. So let's just close this and let's run it. Well, our application is running, so let's have a look. Okay. Well, as you can see, the scroll is not full, so probably we've made some mistakes. So let's have a look. Okay, so we've added a new toolbar, but in the settings, we already have a default toolbar. So let's remove that. 
So coming to our manifest. So let's change the theme here. So we don't need the action bar, we're providing it ourselves. So no action bar, so which is theme.appcompat and no action bar. Okay, so coming back to our main.xml and let's just run the application. Well, our application is running, so let's have a look. Let's scroll it. So as you can see, it's going up, but there is no change of color. You know, it doesn't look like action bar. So let's add another attribute. So coming back to our collapsing toolbar layout. So content is crim. So let's just add a color primary dark. Well, let's run our applications again. Well, now as you can see, when we scroll it up, it looks like an action bar, but there is no title or anything. So let's add that. So coming to our main activity, but before that, we need to add an ID for this collapsing toolbar layout. So ID, say collapsing toolbar. Okay, let's just copy paste it. So copy. So coming to main activity to Java, let's create an instance of that collapsing toolbar layout. So collapsing toolbar layout, let's call it toolbar layout. So find view by ID, r.id, and let's just pass our ID here. So toolbar layout dot set title, let's call it collapsing toolbar. Okay, and let's add some more values here. So dot set collapsed title text color. So when the action bar is collapsed, that means when it looks like an action bar, a thin strip. So then for that, let's define the text color. So get resources, get color uh, dot color, say color accent. Similarly, let's define the color when our action bar is expanded. That means when the image is visible. Okay, so set expanded title color. So get resources, get color, android.r.color.transparent. Well, we don't want to show any title when the action bar is expanded. Okay. So coming back to our main file, everything looks good. Let's run our application again. Well, the application is running, so let's have a look. Okay, let's scroll it up. So now as you can see, uh, when it's collapsed, we can see our title and in the color accent, which was this pink sort of color. So collapsing toolbar. And when we expand it, the title disappears because we are setting the color as transparent. Okay, and there's some padding on left and right. So it's probably some scaling issue with the image. So let's add some attributes there. So scale type, say center crop. Let's run our application and have a look. Well, the application's built, so let's check it again. Okay, as you can see that left right padding's gone, it's smooth, and let's scroll it up. And our title is visible, let's scroll it down. The title's gone and image is visible. Well, that's all for collapsing toolbar layout. If you have any doubts, any queries, feel free to drop a comment and we'll go through it. Take care and bye-bye.